allegedly gonna is actually gonna be a gun. No, it's not. There's no way. It might be. It might be gun in something. Alright, so should we start doing like real commentary now? Yes, yes we should. Right, um, so the thing about these two is I've seen Shilt take lots of games off his wagons, their sets are always super close, especially when it's DK, Meg, uh, yeah, Meta Knight. Like, um, but Swagons tends to win. Yeah, I think Swagons is basically won every time, but it's usually... But it's like, always, yeah. yeah. So... It's actually a Ganon Ditto. Wait, is it actually a Ganon Ditto? Ganondorf. What are you doing, Shilt? He's literally Ganondorf IRL. Well, apparently we've got a Ganon Ditto, so we have an entertaining stream. We have an entertaining stream. Scotland, why? Yeah, I know. I bet Jack is shaking his head. Oh, wait, yeah, no, they're actually doing Ganon Yeah, like... Okay. Pidgey's having oh, a rage right. seizure. Oh, God. A Swaggins with the characteristic R3 because Swaggins is Ganondorf, so... Alright, nice little burst option. Yeah, so I can still me one playing against Ganondorf, no matter if that happens. Yeah, yeah. No matter who you are, it's important to like, remember Ganon's two burst options, which are like his side B and his down B. And if you just sort of keep him out of range and then keep those in mind, he really like struggles, his options are limited. But at the same time, Swaggins is a firm believer that Ganon's not bad. Um, I'm a pretty firm believer of Ganon's very bad. I mean, he doesn't think he's amazing, but he doesn't think he's like bottom five or anything like that. Side B to side B. Which I can believe in. Uh, oh! I... <laughs> oh no. I'd say Ganon's bottom five. Eh, uh, okay, but let's, uh, let's not talk about tier lists, I guess. Yeah, okay. So this is super close right now. I think I'm pretty sure that Ganon should have Ganon. That roll was pretty bad. <laughs> Finally, a matchup Ganondorf can win. Except he can also lose it. Okay. I'm sure Ganon has some matchups that are more. You know, this is going pretty close to me right now. Wait, okay, you can't Ganon. Oh, oh, that could, could that have been a back air? No, Ganon's up no, smashes no, no, deceptively. No, no. Think about how it's Ganon that smashes. Yeah. It's not going to be a back air. Regardless it's of true. When, like, when you think you're going to actually go on the final. Oh, okay, I don't know how I felt about that jump, but the forward tilt came out, I guess, so it worked. Oh, tech it? No way. Wait, okay, swag, okay, I wasn't even sure. I was swagging for one. Yeah, Swaggins always does that with Gandorf. He always grabs the ledge with side B to wait out their invincibility. I wonder if we're going to see a real game after this. <laughs> this is actually no. a... <laughs> this is not a real game. This is, uh, this is actually... No! None yeah. of that. Not a real game. Last time I played against Swaggins, uh, he went Gandorf, but that's only, I feel like that's only because... Uh, we both have made it out of pools, so we're like, okay, let's just have fun. Well, Swaggin' so Scannon is really good, dude. It's really good, yeah. I played Charizard into it. It was a fun set. I'm in Ganon's side of three times. Lovey. It's very lovey. <laughs> I'm impressed by Shields, like Ganon, keeping. Oh, I oh, didn't have break Shields. Shields got a good Ganon. I was actually not aware of this. I think he might be dead. I think there's a pretty decent chance of it. <laughs> the players <laughs> laugh. You didn't give him the satisfaction. Connor, why? I believe. Connor shrugs. Swaggins is apparently staying Ganondorf. Swaggins has confirmed Ganondorf. And Shilt, I don't know. Is he gonna go Shulk? I'm guessing Shulk. Listen, you should have seen pre patched Swaggins before he shaved. It looked exactly like Ganondorf. 100%. <laughs> Literally got. Oh, me too. Shilt. Shilt has a lot of characters, so like, I'm not surprised that he makes sense. Okay, music. music makes sense. Okay. E M2. Like a lot. It seems like he's got a much better chance. You hear MK, you think Meta Knight, not Mewtwo King. Come on, Shilt. <laughs> <laughs> you see, when I hear MK, I think Marth. MK Leo? Oh, oh yes. <laughs> Dude, his Marth is just broken. Yeah. Right. Um, so right, a little weak Shadow Ball. Alright, he's got his charge. Down tilt, that's always fair, great for Mewtwo. Yeah. Oh, that was oh, really okay. good. Not overextending yeah, with more fairs, just realizing that you should fade back and pressure with the Shadow Ball. This is great, this actually. Is, this is very good, yeah. Oh, here as, we go. As long as, as long as she'll, like, just keeps the hell out. So he'll probably be doing a lot better in this matchup, but of course he'll let Ganon get a couple hits and it's like, yeah. yeah. Uh, he will die extremely early to Ganon. Oh, yeah, he's, he's Mewtwo as well. He's probably going to die to, like, back air at, like, 50. The die to, like, say, be dental. Like, no. <laughs> Maybe quite soon, actually, yeah. Yeah, especially if this rage keeps building. Oh. This is funny. I, felt, I feel like I heard Swagon say he might play Ganon. Uh, DK today. I mean, he, he might, you know. I feel like this might be something he would switch to DK for if he, if he was to lose this game. I don't know, it's Swaggins, he might just stay Ganon. Mm. Swaggins is like, <laughs> he's very, I don't know, honor in Smash. I remember last time I played against him at Rebirth, like, he said to me right at the start, um, who do you want me to, um, who do you want to play against today? Who do you feel like playing? I was like, um, I guess Whoa. Mario? And he just Whoa. goes to Mario. And I'm like... <laughs> yeah, he does lose that a bit. Yeah, he's also, a great... Uh, 
just just saying, it was a very nice, uh, that was yeah. very nice. Yeah, yeah, we have to talk about that. Yeah. That dude, You forced him to recover low with the, the Shadow Ball. You just slammed him. Oh, well, right. that roll getting caught by forward tilt and killing so early, even without rage. Ganon's forward tilt's so good. Ganon's forward tilt sends at such a good angle, oh my god. It just eliminates Cloud, even if he's got his jump. <laughs> it's like, I'm not making it back. Straight up back and then he dies. He's... Yeah, this is pretty close, actually. I was, I'm really impressed by um, Condor's Mewtwo, actually. Yeah, have you not seen it before? Uh, I think I've seen little bits of it, but I've not really seen it like in tournament or anything. No, it's pretty good, yeah. <laughs> and he's playing the matchup the way he should be, because he's really not like... I like that um, down smash, down tilt, like the bait. <laughs> that was like a Ganon-esque bait, like with yeah. up smash, forward <laughs> tilt, or like jab or something. I'm a fan. Uh, what's he gonna do? Shadow Ball really reduced that shield. Would fair shield poke ever? Do you think? Well, maybe. Um, maybe. I'm probably not now. Yeah, well, but definitely Shadow Ball does a lot of shield damage, and that's important for Swagons to keep in mind. Okay, in the back throw. Uh, yes. You can just get an edge guard. All right, he's just laying off, getting okay, Shadow he's Ball charge. Yeah. Good, perfect shield from Swagons. Gets a jab. I voted for Swagons for best tag. Just throwing that out there. Wait, best tag. Best tag. I don't remember what I voted for. I think I'm voting for Wii Sports Tennis. That's reasonable. That's also a good time. Just tech. think about it. It's Wii Sports Tennis. I don't even know what the guy. I don't even know the guy. I don't know who he plays oh, or anything. Oh, and that's. Like that. Oh yeah, it's three stock in this play. Yeah. I was like, and that's it. Yeah, that's not the game. Yeah. Well, I was looking quite good for. Oh. Oh. Small dodge with the up smash. So it's still looking quite good for jumping. Like he wants to be careful on the leg. Yeah. Oh, this Barra man. Oh, 33 just from that. From Shadow Ball. 40. Track, yeah. Wow, Shadow Ball is so strong. My word. Very. I mean, I thought um, I thought Ganon was like a. No, it was gonna make shitty camera or home jokes. Never mind. <laughs> I think yeah, Ganondorf looks like a dark type. <laughs> Shout out to Cameron and his amazing sense of shit jokes. I love them. Oh yeah. Oh man, I just realized Cameron said he would interview me today, but I did so fast. Oh, he interviewed me, but it was just kind of awkward. I was like answering all his questions, like, yeah, is there anything else? <laughs> oh, Cameron, no. He's so lovely. He can't, it's impossible. Oh wow, it's looking pretty pretty tough for Swagons here. Really? Oh wait, he's got a hole. It was looking even, but then I realized he's in a higher slope now. Yep. Upstro is going to do it pretty soon as well with all this rage. Me too. I'm Upstro, me too. Alright, if I said up tilt, I was like, wait, what? Ganon's up tilt will do it pretty soon, I think. Just 10. Oh, that smile on both their faces. The oh, the down tilt not getting much off it there, just some shadow ball charge. It's not really committing, which is definitely what he wants to do. Because it definitely feels like um, Swaggins is kind of controlling the pace of the game right now. Like, I don't know, Mute is in the. Oh, there it is. But he keeps on, like, I don't know. He's not hitting him, but he's doing all the running about and challenging when. I guess Mute wants to be in the corner charging, though. So, I guess that's just the nature of the matchup. Yeah, yeah. Here we go, like, Shield's already in the corner again, all his base is gone. But, again, it works fine. Oh, I thought he was gonna go for back throw, because he still walked through, but that did it anyway, apparently. Maybe it was a DI mix-up, maybe it just killed. Maybe, yeah. Alright, one all. Alright. I wonder if we'll see a switch. I've got a feeling. Uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> My speech is serious. Oh, oh yeah, I just switched it to that one. Oh, yeah, sorry. No, no, I, I just mean, like, they're just getting... Wait, it's too late, anyway. Wait, um, how do you mean? Oh, oh okay, yeah. All right. So this matchup is actually pretty awful. For, not awful for me too, but he dies. Wow, 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 wow. I'm pretty sure that DK does pretty good. Mewtwo doesn't. Uh, yeah, because Mewtwo dies at about 55 or 60 to the cargo throw. It's actually crazy. Yeah, and his like large hitbox makes it easier to land. <laughs> like, I don't know. Also, DK just, Swagons is telling me he prefers to fight against tall characters because double back air is easier to land. Yeah, or just back air in general. That should be oh death. God, yeah. 59. Yeah, it's crazy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's what I thought was going to. That's why I thought he would pick DK. Because now he's just got this huge lead and he doesn't have to do anything. Swagons DK is the scariest thing ever. It's very scary, yeah. I had a nightmare about it. Did you? No. No, please tell me. <laughs> well, okay, I was, I was uh, at rebirth. Did you actually have any? No, I didn't actually. <laughs>
I had a nightmare about it, and then I realized I was awake. I don't think I've ever had any smash related nightmares. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, I had one called Straw Hatcher, but it went away after seeing oh, a thing. No. <laughs> <laughs> Just ghost. Oh, that should be. Oh man, he's gonna watch the shield, but a grab will kill. Actually, with rage, no, I probably still will. But like, if Mewtwo like takes any more damage, he should be safe for a bit. Oh, that's it. Oh. Okay, yeah, yeah. Dead. As a pretty proficient DK player myself. <laughs> oh yeah, no, you've got a pretty, you've got a pretty DK, DK. Pretty jolly DK. Oh, I like that, but I didn't. Oh, I didn't realize the range of that. Uh, uh, it's a big fist. It is an enormous fist. Watch Mojo's top ten largest fists. <laughs> <laughs> that's not gonna kill, uh, yeah. even on TNC. And, okay, we just gotta watch out because if DK's charging giant punch on that platform, it's kind of a bait for, oh, come up here and fight me. Oh, you died at I 20. A grab might actually do it real soon because he's a match rage. Uh, probably about 45 or something. I think he might do it in like 30 something. Swaggin says generally, like with rage, he just divides it by 10 and like re removes that amount of percent and it tends to work out. So about 15 off what it normally is, so yeah. Like 40 to 45, I think. Definitely kill him with any. Okay, I think it'll, it does do I think with a pummel. Oh. I wonder if now he's passed it. Well, no, he's not. <laughs> you see the knockback back on that because yeah. he's charging up to that. Alright, he should still be in range, but he's got a decent sized one just because of his like, kickbox size yeah, and stuff. Definitely. Oh, that oh, should be it. Probably gonna be it. Yeah. Wow, that's, JV3. That's definitely a stressful news for matchup for D3, it seems. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well played by Swaggin, I kind of figured he would go DK in game 3 that happened. That Gen in Ditto game 1 was really confusing to me. <laughs> I'm just gonna throw that out oh, there. I know Phil has a gun, so I'm not surprised. But okay. <laughs>